So I cordially invite you all for my first solo show, which is happening in Salla Sat World. Today is going to be my first show, so it's little excited. I'm like I'm little like nervous too actually. So it's like topics what I covered here is like my insights actually. So it's like most of the works here represent my insights, which is like more controversy to the present world. It's like either it's going to be mythological or spiritually based actually. So it's like here I presented with two different kinds of work. One is going to be modern work. Second is going to be the contemporary art what the present age follows actually. So here it's like when you compare to the technique actually the techniques are usually unique here. The technique what I follow is a mixed media which is something is like it's not at collage actually it's like one step ahead of collage actually. So it's like when you're looking at the works I think it's like you can figure it out easily and simple. So it's like it is how it's like how far it's like I worked on it or researched on it actually. This painting is one of my favorite pieces actually. So it's like this is like six by six feet actually. So it's like I never did it's like did or experiment in this big size actually. This is going to be my first six by six plus the experiment which I did is like uh, I've researched a lot and lot actually before starting these works. It's like I took most of the time like spending on the research topic or the it's like controversy what the people will actually look at it how the way technique everything is like so it's like it took more than three months for me to complete this works actually but the, when you compare to the output or the research work it's like now it's like i'm a little satisfied with the output actually so i believe these works actually say about the adam and eve actually but when you compare to the topics or the actual works it's like people always focus on the characters actually when you see it's like you can find it it's like these characters are little it's like taller than our usual people actually so it's like those works i've been influenced with the re renaissance period actually it's like those people are little more muscular than our generation actually so it's like i took those those reference into these things and it's like when you're focusing on these areas like sun and moon it's like sun is compared here with the women actually so in a mythological people always believe that it's like moon represents like women but here it's like in the ancient period people believe that sun is the women god actually and moon are represent with the it's like male actually it's not with their characters but maybe because of the features actually rather than the character so it's like this is going to be one of my favorite pieces and this topic is like adam and eve but the form but the main focus is on the off apple actually it's a two different set and these boxes represent the seven creation what the god created on the very first day of us this is going to be one of my favorite piece plus is the this is how i started with the contemporary art actually so this is my first contemporary works which i did when i was since like more than two to three years actually so this topic is based on the time actually so when we speak about time or something it's like people always believe it's like a lifespan is totally it's like of 100 years or something but it's like this piece tells you that it's like a lifespan of a man or a woman it's going to be only 24 hours actually once the 24 hours is like being done or something it's like people are what it happens like you get an another chance of 24 hours so it's like my concept is like every man has only 24 hours of his lifespan so it is a it works on a circle where once the 24 hours is done the second set of 24 hours is given to you so that's the painting what here it reflects on here it's like every four series i did a four series and this is one among them and every series has a monkey plus a character actually so monkey represent the human brain rather than this like monkey actually here so just to represent the characteristics of the brain it's like i mentioned into a monkey rather than the it's like character here okay when it's like each character it's like it is like little more bended than the usual people it's like just because of the, to show that it's like they run through the times and it's like how it process actually so every painting has a magic square it's like wherever you count actually it's end up with 24 see so the entire concept is like 24 so when you compare it's like any side of these things like either you count in this way or this way it's like it's going to end up with 24 actually so those 24 represent the 24 lifespan of a kind humankind actually mm -hmm.